Hi, Richard Fishenden here again. I want to start with a massive thank you to all of those who got involved in Make Day. It was really good fun. We're just doing the final pieces to the candlesticks just before they get sent out. And if you missed it this time, don't worry, we're planning another Make Day very soon with the Welly Boot Stand. Now, as promised, here is the Make Day video. We hope you like it. Okay, so we're, we'll start at the off-cut pile. This is where the journey started. So this is where we're starting today. Harvey's in the off-cut pile. We're just gonna see what he's doing. So Harvey, tell me what you're doing really quickly. I'm looking for nice bits of off-cut steel to make into our candlesticks. And talk to me, because you said about the seams, you're trying to find ones without right, seams. I'm trying to find ones with, um, without seams in the middle, because uh, we've got two different sorts of fast stock, one with and one without. It's, uh, it's better to have it without the seam in the middle, because it makes it a lot easier to twist later. Okay, brilliant. Okay, so we'll go and have a look over at the forge and see what they're doing over there. Tell me why you don't put it in the big board. Uh, it's just so we can get a bit more of a controlled swing on the yeah. field. If we need our little section, it's just making the twist a little bit yeah. longer. You need to get the camera in so we can watch this twist go in. I'm just going to twist this right in front of your eyes. See, Marcello's just getting that bar now. You can see why he welded the ends on. And he's turning the bar and the twist is now coming in. Beautiful. Yeah. So Harvey said, talk to me about what you're doing here. I'm texturing the, uh, the bottom plate for the candlesticks. Yeah. Just taking a hammer and um, fashion around the centre area here. So you're using that side of the hammer. You're making a ball piece to get a nice dip shape into it. Yeah. I'll do that all the way around, missing out the middle, so I so um. One of my colleagues later can weld the, uh, the candlestick holders that yeah. they've been twisting. Yeah. And then that'll be the completed product yeah. there. And, that, and that's why you just finished. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. So, Robert, tell me what the next process is. What are you doing here? I'm just heating the ends up so I can through them out to let you out with the candlestick. The end, of it, the end isn't currently big enough, so you have to make it bigger. I have to make it slightly bigger on the cone. And how are you going to do that? I want to just heat it up and take the anvil, put it on the cone, tap the end down and flip the end. Okay, are you ready to show us how to do one? Nearly. Hello, let's just stop you there. Talk, talk me through what you're doing here. Right, so I'm just uh, wire wheeling them to give them a nice silver finish. So what are they like? Why are they that colour then? For oh yeah, this is uh, because of the heat that we put in. It makes them like this weird scaly, not a very pleasant colour. So, so you need to turn them to silver we need to using it. this yep. wire brush. So can we see some of these ones you've done? Yeah, sure. So that's what they end up looking like. This is what they end up looking like. And how do we then get that beautiful colour on it? Because they're quite silver at the moment. What do they, we do now? Uh, we basically put them in the fire and uh, we put them in there for about five to seven seconds and then that will bring these lovely shades of blue, gold and green. This purple. is the bit I'm looking forward to seeing. So yeah. let's go and have a look at that. Wow. Oh yeah, I can see that. Can you see those colours? Yeah, that's incredible. Okay, Robert, so this is the final stage, yeah? Yep, the last the stage. On. So what is this, uh, what is this beeswax? This Talk is a nat natural, beeswax. natural beeswax, locally sourced. So, uh, and this rag, this hot rag, beeswax on it? Yep, so it is. And you're just rubbing it down, putting the beeswax in the, what, oh, smell the honey. One finished candlestick. To add to the pile. Add to the pile. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. We're going to let the guys get on now. See you next time.